Hi, I'm Libby, and today we've got a very special version of DGS This Week. This week we're talking to Mr. Metro about his overview of the school year, so let's go. Thank you very much. Well, I started off the new term as, as acting head teacher at Hermitage Academy and although I enjoyed my, my time at the school, um, it was really good to get back to the Noon Grammar School in October. We welcomed a number of new staff to our school community, Darren Boyd, Jennifer McLean, Sarah Moody, Lindsay Derrett and Moira MacDonald in our school office. Our learning centre uh, pupils took part in the King Kern Gala and raised £200 to help um, their youth achievement trips. We also appointed our house captains to Ben Moore, Darren Morgan and Caitlin Reynolds, to Milton, Ewan Robinson and Libby McLean, Kyle, Jason Convery and Maisie Brown, Hafton, Abby Davidson and Mary Gunn, and they were joined by our S5 captains, Xavier Brazemark, um, Cara Chalmers, our head girl, uh, Miles Kavanagh, our deputy, and Siobhan Moore, our deputy head girl, and they joined our school captains to make up our, our SPLT. In September, we hosted a How to Pass evening for our parents. Our chemistry department visited Glasgow University to take part in the Plastics Are Fantastic project. We held our annual S1 Playfair Day, which is um, there to help our young people to respect each other. Our MP, Brendan O'Hara, championed our link to Malawi um, and a debate in Parliament. Martin Ray, our football development officer, hosted a football development day for all girls across Argyll. Um, our pipe band played at the international um, reception at the Scottish Learning Festival in Glasgow City Chambers. And we held another very successful Cara Downey fun run. And this year would have been Cara's last year at Durham Grammar School, so this year's fun run was very special. In October, our history department um, arranged two trips, um, one for our S2 pupils to Stirling and one for higher pupils um, to Hadrian's Wall. Our Can uh, Gaelic pupils had, had a wonderful trip to Canada. Our own Mr Abbott appeared in the television programme Countdown. Um, we held our first Primary 7 Parental Information Evening to, to give parents information regarding the transition. Our seniors held a fantastic Halloween Cayley and there was some great outfits and that includes the staff. Kern Primary moved out of the new Grammar School and into their brilliant new building and our English department moved back into to our own main building. In November we launched our bid to become a rights respecting school and our Pupil Committee visited Hermitage Academy who have just been awarded their Level 1 rights respecting school. Milton House held a, a record breaking uh, event um, in aid of their charity which was Ollie's Wee Bothy and everyone had great fun, um, both the staff and the pupils. Our parent council held a cheese and wine evening for the parent forum for them to come in and review what the, the, the role of the parent council is. Our business and computing department visited a number of local, bus uh, local primary schools um, as part of the Noon Film Festival and also took over the cinema um, um, at the end of the school day. Lauren Bickett and Molly Cosser took part in the National Gaelic debate in Stornoway. Our under-14 Shinty team won the South of Scotland under-14 league. Um, our Arts for Good winning team um, had the opportunity to visit Glasgow University to speak to a number of interested parties in their apps and hopefully one day their app will become a reality, so just keep, keep up to date with that news. Our Business and Computing Department hosted the third um, annual YPI Grand Final um, and this year's winning team was Ollie's Wee Bothy and they were awarded £3,000 towards their charity. Our SPLT took part in Dunoon's Remembrance Parade um, as well. Our Art and Design Department took part in a Creative Industries event at the Borough Hall. We held a Wednesday's day, Wednesday day for children in need. Our new outside catering unit, the Barrow, um, was opened. Mr Johnston, our new Deputy Head, was appointed um, and took up post. Hannah McGlynn, our S, one of our S2 pupils, has made it through to the regional final um, and will represent our Gael at the Future Chef competition. And our National 5 Spanish class had the opportunity to visit Spain and get immersed in the language. In December, our Higher Modern Studies class was visited by our Youth Engagement Officer PC McPhee, um, who answered questions on crime. Chris Mara, a lecturer from uh, Glasgow University, visited our school and spoke with our UCAS candidates and spoke about life at university. Our senior Christmas Cayley was yet again one of the highlights of our year. Our pupils held an inf uh, evening of entertainment um, for some elderly members of our community um, and our canteen provided them with a lovely Christmas lunch. Our School of Rock Show, what can I say about it? It was just amazing. Um, we have some wonderfully talented young people in our school. Our Learning Centre held our annual Christmas fair and raised over £600. We held our Christmas Jumper Day and raised over £400 for next year's YPI 
um, competition. Our drama department arranged a trip to the Panto at the Kings. Our senior pupils were served their Christmas lunch by the, the senior leadership team and helpers yesterday. Um, and finally, our show DGS does Strictly. What can I say? The staff are just amazing, but I didn't realise they were so competitive. I would just like to, to wish um, everybody a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and thank everyone in Dunoon for their continued support of Dunoon Grammar School. Thank <laughs> you.